Okay, so I made the uh, three and a half hour drive to Cabela's today, so we'll just go over the haul that I got. I got an eight pounder of 4064, which I'm really hoping is going to be a good propellant for powder coated bullets. A four pounder of tight group. Two of these were quite expensive, but anyways, I had to get them. I got two empty bottles from the shop. I'm just going to transfer a pound at a time. And replacement brushes, they're getting pretty raggedy, the old ones. Some hops number nine. New shell holder for the 32, uh, self loading. I've been using the one for 3220, but it's a little bit big. Got some patches, 22 to 270 caliber, which is a screw up. I meant to get 30 caliber, but anyway, I got them now, and I'm not going to drive three and a half hours to return them. But the deal of the day was this Williams Diopter Sight FP98. This is the one that mounts on the K98 Mauser and the same sporting rifles. I don't actually have one of these rifles, but it was it was a deal, so I bought it. Original price, 90 bucks. On sale for 44 and then because of this little red thing, some promotion they had today, I got another 20% off of that, so I think that's a pretty good deal. And a good excuse to buy another Mauser, so... Or maybe it'll fit on something I've got already, I don't know. So anyway, there's my haul, so hopefully this will keep me shooting for a while. Um, powders are starting to come back up. The really hard to find stuff is still, you know, Virgit, Virgit Trail Boss. Um, I couldn't find any uh, 4895 or, you know, the really popular ones. They had these, they had a couple other ones. They had some 3031 and 1 pounders. And, to be honest, you're not saving a whole lot. Like the 4064, you're saving 99 cents a pound. If that, yeah, ninety nine cents a pound. Cause this was two ninety nine, and this was one something. It's only a four pounder, and the same thing. I was only saving a little bit. Basically, whatever the powder is, I went through a bunch of the prices. If it's fifty dollars and ninety seven cents a pound, when they put it into the big things, they just take the cents off, and the dollar amount stay the same. But Hopefully this is going to work out for me and replace some of that stuff. I don't know what I'm going to do with those, but it might work. Maybe I'll have to cram two of them down four at a time. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, please like and subscribe. If you're interested in high-tech bullets, I'm going to be doing a lot of testing on that in the next little while. I'm off. I don't go back to work until after the new year, so I have lots of time to develop loads. Uh, i got one on the 303 working pretty good um, I got my lathe geared up now so pretty soon I'll have my 3030 back up and going again I gotta make a firing pin for it and I'll start doing some load data on that as well and probably try some of this out with my 3220 so anyways thanks for watching guys you know, like subscribe leave any comments if you like and see you next time